In the Flex Lexicon Basics video series, you will learn how to create and edit a lexicon in Flex, how to export that lexicon as a PDF, and how to back up your Flex project. To follow along with these tutorials, you should have already installed Flex and set up your Flex project as described in the Flex Project Setup Guides and added any languages or writing systems you need as described in the Flex Language and Writing System Settings Guides. In this video, you will learn how to create a new lexical entry. To begin, open your Flex database and click on the Lexicon tab in the bottom left-hand corner. The Lexicon area is where you can add new lexical entries, edit entries, sort or filter, and configure the appearance of the dictionary. To create a new lexical entry, click on the red and green Add icon near the top of the window. This will open a new entry window for entering basic information about the lexical entry. In the field Lexeme form, type in the item you want to add. In Flex, lexemes can be bound, free, or even phrasal elements. The form you enter here can be a citation form, that is the form that speakers provide when you ask, how do you say X, or it can be an underlying form used in the linguistic analysis. If you will also use Flex for interlinear glossing, you should use the underlying form. Whether you choose to use citation or underlying form for your entries, be consistent. In part two of this video series, you will learn how to enter other forms for specifying the headword used to find entries in the dictionary. Next, select the morpheme type. If you are creating a dictionary based on word list elicitation or lists of citation forms from a word collection workshop, you will probably mostly be entering roots, stems, and phrases. Now enter a gloss. This should not be a full definition including multiple senses or meanings. You will add this later when you edit and expand entries. For now, just enter a short gloss that captures the primary sense. If you have configured your Flex database to have more than one analysis language and are creating a multilingual dictionary, you will see multiple fields, each labeled with a language abbreviation. You can enter a gloss in each analysis language, or just enter one and add information in the other language later. Then, use the drop-down menu under Category to select the lexical category or part of speech. You can add more categories by clicking More, which will open a window with a catalog of additional options including adjectives, determiners, add positions, and more. Select the option you want to add, then click Add. You can always edit the lexical category and any other parts of the lexical entry later. When you have finished filling in the core lexical information, click Create. The lexeme that you just entered will now appear in the list of entries. By clicking on an entry in the list, you can see and edit more information about it on the right.